Welcome everyone to the EcoForest Academy. In the following video we will talk about the new range of EcoForest Pro heat pumps with natural refrigerant R290. Refrigerants have evolved over time. In fact, it is possible to mention that the refrigerants which existed 10 years ago no longer exist. Right now, R410A and R407C are the most used refrigerants. However, although they do not have an impact against the destruction of the ozone layer, they do have an impact for global warming. In 2025, it won't be allowed to manufacture equipment with R410A refrigerant. Then the question arises, why are 290 as a refrigerant? There are several reasons for this. First of all, it is a natural refrigerant. And secondly, it has a low global warming potential. Besides that, it is more affordable and it provides high efficiency and it has a large operation map. Let's check each of these points at a time. It is natural at 100% since it's produced naturally. It is not a synthetic refrigerant as it happens with the rest of refrigerants and it is not toxic for the users nor for the environment. It has a very low global warming potential. This value measures the impact of a refrigerant for global warming. The higher the value, the higher the impact. R410A, which is one of the most used refrigerants, has a global warming potential of 2088. R407C has one of 1,774. R32, which is very popular at the moment, has the same global warming potential as R452B, 675. When checking these values, we may think that 675 is a very value, which it is, but the global warming potential of R290 is just three more than 200 times lower, which means that it's more respectful of the environment. It is more affordable. Since it is natural, it is more economical, opposite to what happens with the synthetic refrigerants, which price increased immensely in these last years. It provides higher efficiencies. Apart from being natural and more affordable, it provides higher efficiencies and a larger operation map. Even for extreme temperatures, it is possible to get better efficiencies than the ones obtained with traditional refrigerants. Let's check the differences in the figures below. In the figure on the right, the blue line represents the operation map of R290 and the red line represents the operation map of our R410A heat pumps with gas injection in the compression phase, also called EVI technology, which means a larger operation map than a traditional R410A compressor. We can see that the R290 can provide high output temperatures even for extremely low source temperatures. The difference might seem low. However, if we compare it with an R410A operation map without gas injection to the left, the difference is very remarkable. This is a very important topic, especially for air source installations, because if having outside air at 7 degrees Celsius means a maximum output temperature of 55 degrees Celsius in the event that the outside temperature is 0 or minus 2 degrees Celsius means that the maximum output temperatures of the heat pump will decrease immensely to 50 or even 45 degrees. This is the main reason why traditional air source heat pumps are not recommended in the renovation market, in which the most used emission systems are radiators. This is also the main disadvantage of R32 if we compare it with R290. A global warming potential of 675 is affordable for the environment, but the fact that its operation map is very limited makes the R290 a more solid option, since it can provide up to 70 degrees in the output, even at minus 10 outside air degrees Celsius. Now we will talk about EcoAir Pro, the range of EcoForest air to water heat pumps with R290 as a refrigerant. At the moment, we have three possibilities the EcoAir 1 to 7 Pro, the EcoAir 1 to 9 Pro, and the EcoAir 3 to 12 Pro. These are the main characteristics natural refrigerant R290, domestic hot water, heating, cooling, and pool heating included, no need for additional modules. 
inverter technology with the broadest modulation range. We are talking about a monolog heat pump. The refrigerant circuit of the heat pump is in the outdoor unit in the R290 is in that unit. What means that the installation is hydraulic and no special permits are needed to perform the installation. Variable speed fans, which allows to have a better control of the noise emission when needed. It is also possible to set a night schedule for the heat pump to be even more silent. Internet connection through EcoSmart is in it. Versatility, the outdoor unit can be combined with up to five different indoor units, two of which have a built-in DHW tank of 165 liters. To conclude, we want to give you some information about the water to water R290 range, the Cogeo Pro 126, which is a unique proposal because it is the only R290 heat pump which can be installed indoors. The reason is that R290 is a flammable refrigerant. The maximum amount allowed indoors without additional security measurement is 150 grams, which is the exact amount contained inside of the EcoGeo Pro 1 to 6. As you may have guessed, the operation range of this heat pump is from 1 kilowatt to 6 kilowatt, and its main features are as follows. Natural refrigerant R290, indoor installation, as I mentioned before, a feature which makes this heat pump unique. Domestic hot water, heating, cooling and pool heating included, no need for additional modules. Inverter technology with the broadest modulation range, internet connection through the EcoSmart EasyNet, and last but not least, versatility, up to four different models in each of the versions, basic and compact. Thank you very much for your attention and we hope you have enjoyed the EcoForest Academy.